Hi, I'm here to give you a brief introduction to Brazil and to Brazilian Portuguese. The first thing you should know about Brazilians is how happy and friendly a people they are. Theirs is a generous and welcoming culture, where even the most modest of families will happily share their food with friends and visitors. In fact, they will share everything they have with visitors just to make them feel welcome. It is also common to ask neighbors for favors and things, etc. Remember, Brazilians are a heart-centered people, which means relationships are really a priority and people always come above things. You will probably find it easy to converse with Brazilians as they are highly social and extroverted individuals. It is also common to be greeted by strangers. In fact, it is seen as a polite habit to do so. Another aspect of Brazilian culture you should be aware of is what is called the Brazilian way, or jeitinho brasileiro. This can be seen as trying to bend the rules, look the other way, or just finding a way out. There are some common examples, like parking where you're not allowed to, managing to travel with more luggage than you're really supposed to, or just cutting the line when you're in a hurry. We should also talk about Brazilian cuisine. It was developed from European, African and indigenous influences. As with music, clothing, architecture and many other traditions, it varies from region to region and it really illustrates the diversity of this country. The most famous foods in Brazil are surely the Brazilian barbecue or churrasco and the traditional feijoada, which is a dish made with pork and beans. But there are a few other dishes I would like to recommend you must eat when in Brazil. One is called pão de queijo, which literally translates to cheese bread and can be bought from most snack bars around Brazil. The second one is pastel. Now, pastéis are like South American empanadas and um, they are stuffed with shrimp, cheese or meat and deep fried. The third dish is coxinha, now, coxinhas are breaded and seasoned deep-fried balls of dough filled with chicken and shaped like drumsticks. But Brazilian food is not the only reason the country is famous, really. We've all heard of the carnival and the samba dancing, but also Brazil is the largest producer of coffee in the world. In terms of sports, we've all heard of Brazilian jiu-jitsu and capoeira, which is a fighting dance, very famous all over the world. Also, the UFC fighters from Brazil are probably amongst the most famous. In terms of natural resources, obviously there's the Amazon forest, but in terms of monuments, it doesn't get much better than Christ the Redeemer in Rio de Janeiro. I would like to give you some stats about Brazil now. It is really a massive country with an area of more than 3,297,000 square miles. Its population is around 194 million, and the GDP is currently around 11,769 US dollars. In terms of borders, they total 10,492 miles, whilst the coastline is 4,655 miles long. In terms of the biggest cities of Brazil, you have São Paulo, with just above 11 million people, Rio, which has just under six and a half million people living there. And then Salvador, that has just above two million and a half. And the capital, Brasilia, similarly, with just above two and a half million people. Finally, there's Fortaleza, that has two million four hundred and fifty thousand.